outskirts of the Kruger National Park. Uh, while we're eating lunch today, a whole herd of baboons decided to fly through here. It's pretty unbelievable. I'm glad I have this lens, I can zoom right in. I'm zooming around towards where my room is. Pretty thick bushes, and then there's a railing here, and a fence. And right opposite is my room number 20. Pretty interesting houses. That's, there's a pool here, you can hear the kids screaming. Basically, it right now. We go out at 4:30, and uh, you know, when the sun dies down, we can actually see what's going on. The animals come out, and uh, we have a drink out there, and then we have dinner. And uh, I'll keep you posted. Here, though. Yeah, no, I got you. Just my face. Yeah, no, I got you. <laughs> Not my stomach. Yeah. This is Joan Harris. She's also from New York, and we're sitting. Right by the pool, around about 2.30 to 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We had a couple of gyms and parks before then. Joan is riding for his cars. Yeah, Joan is riding for her friend. And then down in the city, this year. And, uh, the city girls now. Give this to a lawyer, right? <laughs> yes, 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 that's okay. That's all right, so now, so that's all right. As long as he's not charging me. That'll <laughs> be. Okay. Wait a minute. Yeah. A film where you could actually narrate and talk, Michael, and put yeah. your name on it. Yeah. This is the, the new Sabi Sabi peak that's being sold here. This is all the rage here yes, in Africa yeah. this year. And what is the retail value on that? The retail, well, retail here is 14 Rand, which is probably the equivalent of about $6. Right. right. And uh, pretty cheap when you consider what you get. I mean, it's like affordable. Oh, it's affordable. Yeah. There's <laughs> like a little chameleon. Yeah, well, yeah, it was great shirt the huts. These are the, uh, this is like the camp. We get our own hut. You can see the roll kept very well, very neat. Somebody walking in the walk here. About 4.30, just setting up for that new now. Here's a little meeting room, which is really great. Very pretty. This is near the Zulu. Some different car homes, tables, and Little artifacts, and it's very interesting. This is our outdoor uh, eating place. We eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner in here. Here's our pool, and again, there's my house. That's my cabin number 29. That's the whole thing. All right, I'm gonna take you inside of it now. This is my house. This is the house that Jeff lives in. I'm going to take you around the side here. Here's the roof. Pretty interesting. I mean, this is like really in the uh, jungle. Yeah, those are the bathroom windows. 
I have an air conditioner. I guess I didn't close the uh, bathroom windows. I closed every other window to make sure I didn't get any bugs inside. That's where the uh, bedroom window is, but that's where the head is, and that actually is where the uh, you can see right into the bedroom. You can see that I have my own little fenced-in area here, and then when you look off the edge here, I'm facing right into the uh, game reserve. So uh, it's pretty interesting. I mean, I'm like right out there into the jungle. A little bit of like a moat between here and the uh, the starting point of the jungle. I know it's interesting a lot because it is different. You know, bunks, camps, city. We're uh, in a guarded area. There are also guards with guns all around for our protection. Split door, top and bottom. I don't even lock it, but let's go on in. Let's just see what the hell's going on here. So this is my bedroom. Here's my bathroom. Put on some lights here. Not bad at all for accommodations. I mean, really, when you think about it, I mean, being here in the jungle. Not bad at all. Tub. Everything is very clean and neat. People are great. I have these special baskets in my room. Look at this. This is one of the special lodges because my friend uh, Henry Cartagena, who's one of the executives of South African Airlines, was able to get me this special lodge. Next time, I'll take somebody with me. I mean, it's pretty unbelievable that this is my room when you think about it. It's my pants. You have uh, <clears throat> this chairs. And that's my new hat. Let me show you my new hat. And how do you like that safari hat? Isn't that great? I know you like that. Okay. And uh, I have my own bar. And uh, nice wall pieces. The ceiling is great. I mean, look at this. It's pretty amazing. I have a skin on the wall. And uh, I have this chest here that opens up where I put all my clothes in. And I have another window that I look out right into the forest. And I have like a little uh, uh, chair, but that's that spot right there is part of the uh, Kruger Park here. This is right out there, and the animals just romp right past. Hopefully, we'll get to see some. And right before we go on air, a little bit of rain out here now, slightly drizzly. I can leave some view after the Zulus. You can see here's the camp. It's all sectioned off so the animals can't get in. Hear the birds? Yeah, you got lots of tourists. Main house. You can see the roof again. Lots of people are all going out. We're all ready to go out right now. Maybe you charge us, yes. but if you keep sitting, no problem. And be careful the branch hanging on the road because another branch have the thorn. No, I don't know. <laughs> then don't don't use your hands, you must just duck because another tree is have the thorn. You see us this one. Is this 375? Yeah. 458. No, that one's 375.
No. First time I'm using this one, then Chris. Chris I you can ask. First time I'm using Chris Chris's raffle. Then Chris used this one. Okay, now no, I don't know good. where's the Chris's raffle. Okay. You can ask any question. And if you see something, you can stop me, no problem. Okay. Okay. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> you can see the Rangers. You know the guns. And this is the real stuff. Thanks. Here's the radios. This guy looks pretty mean up there. Looks like we're gonna have some rain. So we're preparing for a little bit of a rainstorm right now. Looks like a little bit of an opening. It might not be raining. Should I show you the picture? Yes. Uh, I could. Or is the video? Only, yeah, it's in here. Yes. So. <laughs> okay. Okay, I want to use it. 
Where's the leper? The other thing. No, this is the one that's very high in vitamin C, right? It's a marula tree. It's a little tiny leaf, like a birch tree, hasn't it? <laughs> yes, your uh, glasses are all uh, rained on. No preservatives on these. <laughs> oh, what thick skin. Thank you. So it is a marula for me. So I can eat this? Yes. How do you do it? You bite it. 
Mm-hmm. Then you take this one. Yeah. You know what? They're very good. Throw it away. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take the skin off. Keep the stone. Yeah. We'll take the skin off, then. Mm -hmm. oh, suck the stone. Mm -hmm. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> So you can put this in the ground and make some more. Push that snowman. Okay, snowman. Teacher, in about three, could you have towels ready, please? Come in all this. Get her, Robert. Yes, the boundary. That side is not our property. very poison trees and if you want to dye the fish you, you, you have the dam and the fish inside you must cut the branch you put it in the dam you can kill all the fish yeah. with that one yeah. sometimes if you find the drops on your eye you can lose your eyesight permanently oh. really yeah very poison oh, nice no animals can eat that <laughs> <laughs> Everybody on? Yeah. Oh, yes? Do you remember when we were off the... <laughs> in Cape Zoga? Which that way went down the front of us. Was that the same thing? <laughs> you want to put that in my room, sir? I left the Ingo Ingo still stay taking the same place. Because they're very dangerous. If somebody stand up, you can see the difference. We have the lion here. Okay, I'll be with you about. You must keep sitting. Nobody can stand up. Last night I sprayed all openings with that bug killer. And of course this morning I woke up there were some beetles on the floor. Some like little like teeny ants near the sink. But for the most part, you wake up and I got like a little bit of a cringe. But it's pretty pretty interesting. And look at that sky. Look out there. Here you can see the setting up for our breakfast. It's six o'clock. It's 
now about 5.45 a.m. on the 20th of February. My camera's had a drain out and dry out last night, the whole night. What I had done is I took them apart and let them sit on top of the lamp. I'm going to zoom in now, I think, on a bird that I see on one of the trees. If I can match it up. I see it from far away. You see it right on the limb there. Up oh, there it goes. I have no idea what that was. That was a bird. There's like a little bit of a bridge here, you see, right underneath my uh, room here. Last time we actually saw an eye, a lion. <coughs> Excuse me, I saw a lion last night attacking an impala. They actually uh, went around it like in a box shape and then came zooming right in on it and, and uh, attacked. If the camera would have been working, I would have gotten the attack. But it was pretty amazing where the uh, lion just came in and just jumped right on it. So people have seen some buffaloes and giraffes, and I guess I'll see all that this morning. The best time to go is either late at night between let's say six and eight and nine and uh, early in the morning around six o'clock so we eat at six and i guess we leave sometime around 6 30. the sun will start rising soon 5 15 when i was up there was no sun but uh it's pretty quiet very pleasant i know about sort of relaxing it's a little bit of you know a little nervous but it's okay next time i won't go by myself now 10 to 6. I sure hope it doesn't rain out. It looks like rain up there again. Um, when the first one out, I guess there's a little bit of a, uh, a snail here. Look at this. Uh, I can tell you the rain. Let all the animals come out. You can hear the, uh, you can see the tea set up here. Set up for the tea. You can hear the uh, engines going on for the rovers. But it is pleasant. And spooky. Believe me. I guess you can't zoom in on it. I'll take the watch off. Yeah. Oh, my watch is some of that spray stuff. You know, the uh, insect repellent. Doesn't taste too good. So we're going to place the watch right on the table here. Put it on an angle. Zoom in on it so you can really see what time it is. Okay guys, let's see, does this work? Not such a good idea, huh? Let's go to the macro. There you go. Look at the time it is. Yeah. I guess you can see what time it is there. The uh, minute hand is like eight. It, it's like eight minutes of the hour. And the wonderful hour is six. Right there. Could be. Bird, it looks like maybe it's me or a baboon. I'm going to take out my binoculars and take a look. Então <laughs>
what is it? It's the velvet monkey. Maybe you see something or leopard or lion like that. Uh, Those are velvet monkeys? Like an evergreen smell? Lavender, lavender. What? Was it ants? No, that poor mark there, look. Oh. Did you go so? Land Rovers can drive around, we have no space to take a picture for the leopard.
Right in front of us. Well, I've just got to the open area on business. Where do I come from here? Okay, go down. Uh, which way are you coming? Huh? I came down business one. I've just got to the junction business one and two to the open area. Okay, go down to a bush lodge and you'll see Basil and Louis. Drive past them and you'll see the track going to your right, like a track. That's the drainage line. And you follow that track and you come on the southern section, southern side of the drainage line. You no get the PC, you know? No road.
into my hut and you can see the uh, lady girl that just walked in as I was walking out. Speaks no English. Speaks Zulu. Yeah, so it's pretty interesting. Take some shoes off. Don't you guys have. smell again. What is the picture of zebra? What kind of zebra? The picture. You can see the black and white straps that the... No one can see me, trust me. The shell straps between all the black and white straps. And the female take the lead, I control which way I go, where to go, how to go, like a human being. come the back because of the very back kick to defend the female. Sounds like they're talking.
Bless you. Outside. Then if the if the female lying, you, you want to put the eggs there. Yeah. You lose all the feathers. Mm -hmm. You make them a soft nest for the young one. Then you put the eggs there. Then the eggs, the the young one hatching. The female is sitting there, and the fem the the male. You go and take the insects. You feed the female and the young one inside. Yeah. Once the young one's coming, then you get, you get the, the feathers, the young one, and the mother must get the new feathers. Then if you're bigger, you broken again the holes, then you come out to fly away. Nice. <laughs> yes. Then I think the, the young one's there. Mm. That's why the female come and feed them. Mm. OK. How old's that one? How old's that one? That one? Yeah. I don't know how old oh. I can get, but maybe 15 or 17 to Oh, so it's a teenager. <laughs> Really, he's moving. <laughs> That's probably the fastest turtle. <laughs> he's not moving too fast. He 
He's not like his other friend. Up oh, there he goes, he's moving. So those are the ones that get very big, right? Yes, sometimes the big ones. So I guess... Anyone's it's interested to holler at one? It's a black belly core one. Yes. Got this black belly core one. So the giraffe is sitting down now. You don't see no, that. No, the buff crested coral. Or red chested coral. It's, a, it's number two. So we saw number one and we saw number two. <laughs> yes. Oh. Uh, so the giraffe is sitting down now. That's not too common, I guess. No, the giraffe is do lying down, but just the rest. The giraffe is sleep 20 minutes or 24 hours. That's all I sleep. Yeah, the giraffe is very vulnerable if you lying down. It take a long time to get up. Can sleep 20 minutes or 24 hours. Short, short, short time. Let it do a rest. And this up, this branch you saw here. This tree. Yes. Then after three years, four years, if you have the rain, the grass it can come up. And then you can take the tractor with a thresher and cut all the branches here. Then you have nice open area. Because if you did the open area with the zebras. The cheetah can run 120 110 km per hour. You can see the grass. So where is where is that tree poisonous? The leaves or? Oh, that one. If you you can't take the wood to make it the cooking fire. If the smoke is coming on your, your food, it can damage all the stomach. Yes, but yeah, that but that one is the phobia right but the same poison is very poison in that one. And the if you take one leaves, you can see the moldy substance coming out. If you get that one on your eye, you can lose your eye supplementary, mm -hmm. and you can make a good furniture for you. Good furniture? Yes. Hmm, so maybe that's good for me. Make special chairs for the mother in law to sit in the Yeah. <laughs> I can make some fe special furniture for some special people. <laughs> it's the it's the the gift that they'll always remember. <laughs> Muddy over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, those animals are so beautiful. It's very easy day to find male and female zebra. The male have black and white strap, and the female have white and black. Maybe can get stuck there. Uh -huh. And the male adult impala have 90 female. 90? Yes, he control all 90 female keep happy every time. But he live just only six years, he die. Because he's working hard. <laughs> Boone a velvet monkey. 
Very bad. <coughs> very bad monkey. Bad monkey? Bad? What'd you say? Very? No, the baboon and velvet. Oh, velvet. velvet yes. The monkey is chasing the baboon away. Is it? Yeah. yeah. You would think that, wouldn't you? Yeah, you see the baboon. Yeah. Um, <laughs> 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 I think it's another group. I think the hoodland kingfish here is number one. Number one, woodland kingfisher. Yeah, yeah. The kudu. Kudu. Is that one jumping over the fence? Wow. It's easy. I guess it is when you're that big. Shed those horns at all, or do they just keep growing? No, just grow. Just grow all the time. Is she so good, Uncle? Very careful, okay. Well, I'll take a walk down to the river. Hey, don't go so fast. <laughs> hey, guys. Really, right through the thick of things here. Buzzing past my head. The river's moving pretty fast. so funny. Yes. Um, 
baby over there. So they just like go in the water, they don't, uh, they're still standing in place, right? Sometimes do standing walking in the water, but now I think it's swimming. Because the water is full. See the baby there? This one is the small one. See the small one? See the small one is swimming because he's going that way and then he comes back. That's right, he does, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the black rhino and giraffe. They can eat it. Yes, no That's problem. That's a poisonous. Uh -huh. It's no poisonous than animals. Giraffe and black rhino. We eat this. What's that back
<laughs> so what are we looking for now? <laughs> uh, now we, we can try look the rhino. Maybe we can find them. And buffalo. It's absolutely beautiful out. Well, this shrub beats the rain. Ibis? Yeah. Oh. Hi, Ibis. Two. Nice. Want to do that again? <laughs> the Adidas Ibis. Make the big nose. Ha, ha, ha. I got you. I got you. Uh, is it? <laughs> Boundary, and that's like another property. But if we have the animals here, yeah, we can try. But you can see the uh, the select rubber line there. Yeah. We can go in that side. We call the northern that side, and this side is our property. Have oh, that one told? Yes. Yes. That is the bone. We drive all this road to find all the lion lying down. So what do you do with all the bones? Do you pick them up or? No, oh, just the hyena coming and clean it, eat everything. And the, all the bait, scavenger, the yeah. marble stock and vultures, yeah. and hyena and black bag jackal. Then just to leave the bones like that. Up that we saw this morning. What were they after? Were they after the remains of the leopards killed or something else? Where? Yeah, we saw vultures this morning. Yes, is there? Oh, it was the leopards. Yes. There's yes. the skull of the little baby one. Look. Is that the skull? The skull there. Oh, no. The little baby. Is one. it? Is it or is it? No. Uh, I think it's um, one of his backbone. Yes. The backbone. Yes. Okay. It looks like a little skull. Yes, there. tiny bit. Oh. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. 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 These guys could be doctors. <laughs> <laughs> What's it called? Go away birds. Grey lorry. Go away birds? Yes. Go away. The sound make. Oh. The grey lorry. Africans and quay for. <laughs> Number four? That one? Yes, four. Yes. We saw those in that Cape Town bird sanctuary, didn't we? Was it in Cape Town or yes. was it in Cool? What kind of noise does it make? <laughs> <laughs> what, that's the kind of noise it makes? It's the laughing bird, huh? 
can see number five. Yes. Mm -hmm. Close it, but run away. Chase her, now, Juan. Sorry? Would, it, would the jackal kill one of those deer? No. The scavenger, but you can't take this one. Oh, the young impala. It's a dung beetle. Oh, it looks like one's just having a ride. Yeah, if another one came, yes, took it away. Yes, yes, it fights it. So, what is this? It, 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 it just takes waste? Yeah, droppings. And then it wasn't for those, it wasn't for those. That one, it takes take this one. Okay. The dung beetle. Yeah. You, you find the dung, then you roll it, make the ball like that. Yeah. You roll it, you find the, the place. You're making the hole first, and then you're taking the dung. You put, put it in the inside. Yeah. Then you go inside to eat it. Yeah, you eat the dung. But sometimes you find the one. If you find one rolling, just one, it's the female. You take that one, you rolling, you go and make the hole, then you put it. You go inside, you eat all inside there. Then you, you lay the eggs. The eggs, if you hatch there, you can eat the dung. Then come bigger, coming out. I see, I see. But I don't understand why the female is having a ride. The male is pushing it, the female is just having a ride. Is she going to use yeah. it maybe for, for, for laying her eggs in later? Yes, the female pushing, the male is the small one. Oh, the male is having a yeah. ride. So the female is doing all the work. Yeah. That's the right, ride. that's the way it's supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> Rhino's not going to charge us, is he? You got my running <laughs> We don't run. No. I have my running shoes on. They can't, they can't see very well. I've got the tennis shoes on. I got, my, get past me I got my running shoes on. If he comes near me, I can start to run. No, don't do that. So there's a white rhino you're showing us? Yes. <laughs> I can't old. take you to the black rhino because it's very dangerous. What's he doing? I know he's running. Is there anyone else? He's not doing anything else, he's just doing this.
already in on these rhinos. Whoa. Holy mackerel. You gonna have to turn around? This is a good foot if you want to dive. <laughs> they gotta turn around now. Yeah. Hey guys, a bad face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's in the mother and young mare. Wide rhino. Raymond, can you take us? I'll be leaving. Do you have balls in the car? Yes. Do you have the balls in the car? Mm -hmm. Yes. The yes. But also. I think it was a problem. It's time for sundown. So I got one in the car. No raisins, thanks. I want to get myself on TV. Just have some nuts. <laughs> Thank you. Do I say hello to my friends? Mm -hmm. Say hello to my friends. Hello. <laughs> hello, my friends. <laughs> how to open the bottle of wine without an opener? Yes, uh, how to do it without an opener. I've done that before. So you going to shoot it open? No. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh, you're going to take a bullet out? Yeah, push it down. Thank you. Just say hello to my friends. Hello, my friends. Camera friends. I want to the bullet inside. If you shoot, shoot a lion now, you'll be drunk. Put the ring in there. He's the one who ordered the wine. I'm the one who ordered the wine. Oh. So, it's for everybody. <laughs> well, if it doesn't want it, doesn't, you know. I know. So you can have some wine with me? Sure We're not doing too good with the wine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you have no screwdriver? Uh, oh, that's good. good. I've done it that way also, too. Uh, so I'm gonna it too. That's good, that's bullet wine. <laughs> we like to ask that kind of thing. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, Anybody want to bullet wine? We're not very good boy scouts, are we? Oh, no. <laughs> That's some glass of wine. I made a mental note for the next time. Oh, thank you. This is some glass of wine. <laughs> Someone like it? Anybody yeah, want to sip? Yeah. Maybe like that. Yeah, I'll have a glass of wine. A drop of wine. A drop. Of wine. Give him the whole thing. Gonna... No. <laughs> I'm going to drink some beer. Yeah. Can you open my mineral water for me, please, Jim? Now, that is a shooting off job. This one? Yeah. That's what I would well done. Yeah. Thank you very much. That's good. Oliver, if I hold your beer, you open that for me. 
clean up the rubbish in case a frog eats it. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Yes, cheers. 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 Did you have a drink? Where's your drink? Yes, this one. Oh, it's a small What's little that? drink out there. <laughs> and you're okay? Mm. Wonderful as well. Mm, cheers. 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 So this is African wine, and that's African beer. <laughs> yeah. This is. Uh, you having juice? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. This is African wine. I always buy African wine now in England. Do you really? Yeah. It's good wine, and it's cheaper than than inferior French wine. Yeah, and we had some excellent stuff. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers everybody. Cheers. 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 Oops. Oops. Cheers, Jeff. Oops. Cheers. 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 Come on, mineral water, lady. Right. Yes, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, look. The dog. Hyena. Hyena. <laughs> Yeah, that's just, that's that's hyena. Mm. 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 He just thinks there's some scraps. He hear the noise. He come in, I want to he come and join Maybe us. he thinks there's something to eat. Mm. Is there really enough light to use that thing? Yeah. That's good. Yeah, it's yeah. a bit scary. My camera's giving up. I get half a second now. Yeah. There's a baby. Way it works. Yeah. 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 Oh, I see him. Here he is. Huh. Shakur, you remove. Shakur. Shakur. It's our moon. See the, the uh, countryside here in the dark. And now I'm going to swim over to the The lock at the present moment is mobile again. Between, it's on progress. Between junction Zebra 2 and back road Zebra 2. And they've just turned off uh, into Latin, moving more or less in the easterly direction. We'll leave a branch on the road and we'll stand by for you. I'm making the way more or less towards Top Road Zebra. Copy, thanks. I can't get any more uh, light in that. Sounds good. Yes, sir. Let us slowly move about towards this. Yeah, they're moving pretty Unmet slow. Hmm, take a break. It's fantastic. We're going for a little night walk. It's 5 to 6. On the 21st. Tuesday morning, I'm leaving today. And, uh, so we're ready for having our tea this morning. Yeah, this seems like a very good morning. But it is this morning. It's quite extraordinary. It's so quiet, peaceful. I hear all the animal sounds. Last 
but I uh, put my key in the door, kept it in from the outside, closed the door, and of course, you know what happened? It locked. I could not get out of the room. So I actually climbed. And he locked the room, so I actually climbed. I'll show you right through the bathroom window there. Because they had these big keys. I'll show you what they look like. City of the keys. I noticed those big keys, like keys to a city. And uh, what happened was it flipped the lock closed, so I got locked in the room. So it was a little fun. Alright, well, we're ready for our tea, and we're going out this morning. Okay. Yes. Good morning, sir. <laughs> uh, it's nice money. Well, I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I Maybe Richard can find a yacht, you are a buffalo. Yes? We're going to find the buffalo today? Sometime. You think so? <laughs> okay. Any mobile game progress back to the Zebra They make any noises? Yeah, okay. <laughs> so you wanna you wanna you wanna try or what? Whoa! Do you wanna give us a uh a, 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 yeah, that's a, you know, whatever they do. <laughs> Richard, you wanna give us some noises? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you, Rich. Yes. The questions are insects. White crown swipe. White crown swipe. Very nice beard. White head. Like an old man. Yeah, it's cute. <laughs> <laughs> Picture of this. Uh... And this water is for the rain. If you have no rain, <coughs> you take a, a tank with a with a tractor. It comes the water and was driving, and come and put here. Because this area not for animals, but we have no water inside right, this. So you have to keep that for that. Yes, so keep the water here. Yeah. And this one and that one you saw upon the road there called the lion pen. Yes, the lime pen. Yes. Also, you, you fill up. Yeah. But now we better for it. Yes. This one is very sharp. You can't feed the animals here. Yeah. Well, they would become a nuisance, wouldn't they? Hmm. You can see the red bump. On yeah. that one, to the female. Yeah, if you start to feed them, they'd always come, they wouldn't... Uh, jump on the be, car. Yeah, they jump on the car. Oh. Can't get too close, they run away. Mm -hmm. What are they? I don't know the name. You're having a piece. Do you want to the sea, Yeah, I'm going to grow these trees in the air.
Inside, maybe it's crossed already. Bamba the test. I corner me, I've tried that already. No. Raymond, what kind of snake is that? No, it, it, it takes uh, prey and wraps itself yeah, around it. This is a baby That's still This guy should have this before. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> this, we're so close. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's just real. <laughs> So that's a baby python? Yeah. We've we, we got one on the property that's about 18 foot. 18 foot, and that's and about seven? <laughs> this is five. Five. Uh, just sitting around. Please well talk.
How many do you think there are totally? How many? How many? The buffalo. Yeah. <coughs> Couple hundred and twenty, hundred and fifty. Oof. You can see here, yes, all the buffalo is there. Okay. The buffalo. In the bush. Then I drive, I start tracking the, the spore, yeah. then I find them here. Yeah. Yeah. Because, yeah. <coughs> because, if you, uh, because if you find the spore once, we have many roads here. You, you can't take a track you follow, but sometimes you can find the buffalo very close to the boundary. Yeah. Then if you see you, you can cross the boundary. And the guests didn't see nothing. Yeah. Now I drive around, maybe it's very close to the boundary. I can Stop. find the zebra, yeah, that, mm -hmm. the buffalo that side. Mm -hmm. Now I know it's not, it's not close because if you're very close to the road, I can see if I drive you. Yeah. That's but what you tried to do with the line, wasn't it? To stop him yes, going over? Yes, yes, That's yes. That's good. Very good. Yeah. Now somebody can come and see the buffalo, but last night you saw the buffalo at the night. You can't take the picture. No, they're no. black and it's black. Mm -hmm. It's yes, no good. But no. now it's very nice. Yeah. Yeah. We got some super shots of the water. Mm -hmm. That was really good. Bye, bye. Was in your eye? Can I pull him around? Better visual? Yeah, mm -hmm. the same bed. The red bed ox beggar. Take the ticks and the parasite number five. Is this one here? That one. Yeah. You clean it. Take the parasite and the ticks. Right off of the uh, animal, huh? Yes, yes, yes. You find them in the. All the animals, without the elephant, the elephant don't like the small bears like that. Yeah. Getting disturbed. <laughs> but all the hippo and wild white rhino and buffalo and impala and kudu like that, you can find these bears busy. I can say this bear is waking, but it's not waking because they feed themselves. They eat it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Hello? You see the bull is there, with the black patch on the face. Where is that? Right in front of us? Yes, that one. You can see the black black patch. That one is going down. making all that noise. Is that, is that you, Richard? Richard, he's making all these noises. <laughs> that small one we born November, December. The station period for Gorillas is seven months. That's that pretty fast. We the born last of last year, December, November. That one's Is it called Nyeri? Nyari? Nyari. Nyari. Then we put the cup on. It was like roll on the in the in the mud. Looks like he's stalking something. Yes.
my bird catch something. You think it sees something now or? Want to walk. Go fly away. Yeah, you want to do that? Okay, Jason, let's see. Special marula berries yes. here. I gave you this. Thank you, Rick. This bag, I appreciate it. Marula. Marula and uh, and the berries. And oh, what? What? Oh, those are the ones. Yes. Good. Good. Yeah. Good, <laughs> good. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. And this is uh, the crew is right before the airport. Yes. Some more people coming. 